Bemid bar Numbers 13. And Yahuwah spoke unto Moshe, saying, Send you men, that they may search at the land of Canaan, which I give unto the children of Yasharael. Of every tribe of their fathers shall ye send a man, every one a ruler among them. And Moshe, by the commandment of Yahuwah, sent them from the wilderness of Paran. All those men were heads of the children of Yasharael. And these were their names. Of the tribe of Reuven, Shamua, the son of Zakur. Of the tribe of Shimon, Shaphat, the son of Chori. Of the tribe of Yehuda, Kalev, the son of Yephuneh. Of the tribe of Yeshekar, Yigal, the son of Yosef. Of the tribe of Ephraim, Husha, the son of Nun. Of the tribe of Binyamin, Palti, the son of Refu. Of the tribe of Zevelin, Gadiel, the son of Kodi. Of the tribe of Yosef, namely, of the tribe of Manasseh, Gadi, the son of Kuchi. Of the tribe of Dan, Amiel, the son of Gamilii. Of the tribe of Asher, Keter, the son of Mikael. Of the tribe of Naphtali, Nakbi, the son of Vophtzi. Of the tribe of Gad, Geuel, the son of Maki. These are the names of the men which Moshe went to spy out at the land. Rather, which Moshe sent to spy out at the land. And Moshe called Husha, the son of Nun, Yahusha. And Moshe sent them to spy out at the land of Canaan, and said unto them, Get you up this way southward, and go up into at the mountain, and see at the land what it is, and at the people that dwell therein. Whether they be strong or weak, few or many, and what the land is that they dwell in, whether it be good or bad, and what cities they be that they dwell in, whether in tents or in strongholds, and what the land is, whether it be fat or lean, whether there be wood therein or not, and be ye of good courage, and bring of the fruit of the land. Now the time was the time of the first ripe grapes. So they went up and searched at the land from the wilderness of Sin unto Rekov, as men come to Chamat. And they ascended by the Negev and came unto Shevran, where Akiam, Sashai, and Talmai, the children of Anak, were. Now Shevran was built seven years before Sor An in Mitzrayim. And they came unto the brook of Eshkol and cut down from thence a branch with one cluster of grapes, and they bore it between two upon a staff. And they brought of the pomegranates and of the figs. The place was called Nakal Eshkal because of the cluster of grapes which the children of Yasharael cut down from thence. And they returned from searching of the land after forty days. And they went and came to El Moshe and to El Aharan and to all the assembly of the children of Yasharael 
unto the wilderness of Pa'aran to Kadesh, and brought, brought back word, rather brought back word unto them, and unto at all the assembly, and showed them at the fruit of the land. And they told him and said, We came unto the land whither you sent us, and surely it flows with milk and honey. And this is the fruit of it. Nevertheless, the people be strong that dwell in the land, and the cities are walled and very great. And moreover, we saw the children of Anak there. The Amalekim dwell in the land of the Negev, and the Chittim and the Yevrosim and the Emarim dwell in the mountains, and the Kanaanim dwell by the sea and by the coast of Yardan. And Kalev stilled at the people before Moshe and said, Let us go up at once and possess it, for we are well able to overcome it. But the men that went up with him said, We be not able to go up against the people, for they are stronger than we. And they brought up an evil report of the land which they had searched unto the children of Yashadael, saying, The land through which we have gone to search it is a land that eats up the inhabitants thereof. And all the people that we saw in it are men of a great stature. And there we saw at the Nephilim, the sons of Anak, which come of the Nephilim. And we were in our own sight as grasshoppers, and so we were in their sight.